Well, from one mat possibly clearing to another one, Greg will tell you who's coming up next. Our next competitor getting ready to take on the course is 19 years old from Ackworth, Georgia. He is a coach at and represents Ninja Quest, and he is a gentleman and a scholar. Put your hands together <laughs> for Matt Hall. Five athletes remain. And this man may be the pick out of the five to defeat stage three, a feat that no one has ever accomplished in the top division of the NNL. We have seen a few athletes in the young adults division and in the uh, kids division as well, and in some of the other youth divisions. Uh, I can remember Oliver Lutman essentially speed running this stage. We've seen clears this week, but never in the top division. Matthew Hall was right there last year, and he knows every single touch point on this course this year, that's for sure. Makes a jump onto the cane. He has waited 16 long months since that incident in Greensboro, North Carolina. And he is looking to win the world championship, but more importantly for him probably is hitting that buzzer something that we've said that no one's ever done. But I was talking to a lot of people that thought Matt Hall had the ability to do it. And right now, he is looking very clean. I am enthralled by this run. And again, taking that strategy that we saw just like Capel in employing of taking a quick rest while Here's the on reverse the grab, got it. He is the fourth out of the six male competitors to make that reverse grab. Now two, Matt Bradley and Josiah Papel have been the edge of dreams by touching cheese wedges. Neither have made the grab. And you can kind of see from the live stream, I, I don't have the uh, monitor in front of me, but you can see in some vantage points that those cheese wedges are actually offset. Essentially a wingnut transfer of vertical limits. Is it even possible? I think if any athlete is going to be able to execute it, it's going to be Matt Hall. I'm holding my breath here. There's the jump, he touches it, not able to clear it, and he did not do it faster than Matt Bradley. So now, I, I think it is safe to say that the remaining four athletes are gonna rush to cheese wedges with a clear maybe out of reach.